wanna keep it low now If you wanna go, let's go Let's wrap it up and hit the road I just got an awesome vibe Striking the wind of hopes now Liberty's on my mind We've taken off, we've left the ground You You gotta understand That we get one chance, one chance. Hi guys Welcome back to the channel I've been to Enkiwa and I'm gonna show you guys what I got Okay, it's super duper late guys. <laughs> I just went out to the car to get the box out of the car that I had in there um, because I have been working but I did manage to go to NQR between me sort of, I was working, then I ran to NQR, then I had to come home, cook dinner, and then I went back out working again. <laughs> so I was just like, oh, I've got that stuff in the back of the car because there's a couple of things in there that I need. So I'm going to show you what they are um, just for some birthday parties tomorrow. So I thought, you know what, I'm just going to film this and show you guys what I did get. It doesn't form part of my grocery, like main grocery shops or anything. It was literally, I went in there for a couple of things that I knew about um, and some birthday things that I needed. And I thought, well, I was in there. I thought, oh, have a look. There's a couple of extra things that I wanted. So I went and grabbed them. So I just thought I'd share it with you guys because it was just a little shop. NQR, if you don't know what it is, there's not that many around in Australia, but if you're near one, they are kind of like a bit of a hit and miss as far as having deals. Like sometimes I'll go there and I'll get so many things. I just think lots of snack things usually. So I'll get so many things and I'll think, oh, this is amazing. I've saved lots of money and they're really good for that. Now, it's usually like end of line sort of stuff or things are about to go out of date so that kind of thing. So you need to be aware of that basically. But a lot of the times if it's stuff going out of date, like it could be like chips or something like that, then it's just like a best before date. So it's usually fine, honestly. So it's worth getting it if you can. And you save a lot of money. So I do do that. Sometimes I'll go in there though and I just don't want anything. Like I just don't like anything in there and it's just, yeah, is what it is sort of thing. So... I take advantage of it. I pop in there every now and then. If there's something, then I'll grab it just as a little extra, a little purchase. You know what I mean? So that's what I did today. Um, so I spent $29 today and this is everything that I got. This was the box that I was dragging <laughs> because they don't have bags there. I don't, do they have bags? I don't think they do. So I just always put stuff in boxes because I think I'll use boxes or I can break them down and put them in the recycle bin. So that's what I did. Um, so I've put everything in here. Just let me get it out. In This was a great deal, this one. Let me get it and show you what I got. I got tubes, tubes. <laughs> Have you guys had these? I had these as a kid, absolutely love them. They're back in the supermarket and actually you can get these in like plastic packets of five. So there is five bags in here. Let me open one. They're like this, if you can see. Um, so in the supermarket, they don't have them in boxes, I don't think, in the supermarket. They just have them, like the five packets like this, in another plastic bag. And it's usually like two packets, so you get ten, is that right? Ten mini packets for $7. That's the deal you usually get. This deal, I got each one of these boxes for $1. So instead of paying $7, $7 for two of these, they cost me $2. So $2, not $7. <laughs> so I got, so the deal was you actually got a big box like this. The deal was you actually got a big box of five boxes like this for $5. So that was awesome. Um, I just bought them because they were so cheap and yeah, we like them. And I thought it's just a cheap extra chip sort of snacky thing that I can put away and just bring out when we need them. So, oh, and the best before is the 31st of March, 2024. And it is now about 10 days later. It's April 10th, I think, roughly. So still, they'll still taste fine. We've got chips like this plenty of times and they've been totally fine. And I'll just point out right now there, I didn't get them because we don't really eat them, but they have those veggie straws there at the moment too. I think they were 2 or $3, maybe $2.50 for a pack of five. So that was a really good deal too. Instead of paying like $7 for two packets, you could get two packets for five. I also got this wrapping paper um, just to wrap some presents for the kids. They've both got birthday parties tomorrow so I decided to get just some of this because I was absolutely out of it and I was just kind of, I was there and I thought great I'll just grab that quickly. But it was a pretty good deal. It's three meters for two dollars. That's not bad. It's not you know high quality paper or anything like that but it's literally going to go tomorrow on a present and be open straight away so I think it'll do the job. 
I also got two birthday cards. Now, this one here is for a teenage boy, and this one is for a girl that will be, I think she's turning seven. Um, so I thought they were both, you know, suitable, I'll say, for the ages. This one, I just thought the girl would really love, you know, it's pretty, it's got foil, it's got the nice sweet drink on it, treat yourself. I thought it was just a nice thing. You could probably, is there anything, there's nothing in here? Today is all about you, so that's really nice. So you could use this for probably a number of different things, not just birthdays, because it doesn't say happy birthday. Um, but yeah, they've got a really good selection of this style card. Plus, these were $2 each, by the way. Whereas, I, if I was buying this in Big W, I'd probably have to pay at least $6. I don't know if there's a price on these. No, there's no price, but it would probably, but this style card would be at least $6, probably. Um, and... I, they do have other cards there that are more like maybe Frozen and things like that. They're about $1 or $2 as well. So it's a good place. They don't have a huge selection, but it is a good place that I get cards from. So I like to get those. This is the boys one. This one does say happy birthday. It says happy birthday. You're awesome. I actually picked this because the boys, Joseph's age, are into colognes. <laughs> They're just into buying these nice smelly things at the moment. Wearing sunglasses, trying to look cool. So I thought he'd like this card. There's nothing inside of it, but that's fine. Joseph can write something. So, oh, it says blank card for your message in style. I don't know whether, it doesn't say that though. No, it's just, it is blank. Um, but I don't know. It's a nice looking card. I thought it was pretty cool. This would do a number of ages, really. You could get this from teenage boy right up to... 99 years old do you know what I mean like I think it would be suitable but I just thought for this particular person I thought that would be a good choice I actually went into NQR specifically for this product because Rhiannon had seen it I was on video chat with her and she was in there and she said oh they've got Vicks here and I'm like oh, I need Vicks I didn't know that it was the extra strong one which I've never really seen before so I don't know I mean it's probably in the chemist like that but I've not seen it in the supermarket I don't think in any case, it was $3, and that's why I got it. I'm out of fix. I probably won't use this on the kids. It's literally just for me at night. I put just a little bit under my nose, like the smallest amount ever, um, just for the smell. It relaxes me. I just have a tendency to not to be able to relax at night in bed. My mind's always racing. I just like to think up new brilliant ideas. I don't know. <laughs> I just I find it very hard to relax um, and go to sleep. You know what I mean? I'm always trying to do new things and create and all of that. So this just helps me sleep. So that's why I bought it. So it was $3. It's not a very big jar. What is that? 50 grams, I think. But for $3, that's amazing. While I was in there, I saw these. Now, I don't think... This is cooling peppermint, so I think they'll taste nice. Normally, we get the ones that I think are like a butter menthol type taste. I don't think I've seen these ones in the supermarket, but... They are very expensive normally. What's this? A pack of 24 in the supermarket's probably at least probably $7 maybe, I think. Uh, and these were $3. So I did grab these to go with that when we need them. The kids, again, don't like these. It's just purely for Johnny and I usually if we need them. Um, and they do tend to help with like dry coughs and stuff. So we like to have those around at times. So I got these. Hopefully they're good. I don't know if they've got an expiry. Yep, September. So we've still got months ahead for that. So that was a really good deal for $3. That's amazing. I also got a toothbrush each for Johnny and I because we just need new ones. They're Colgate ones and they were only $1. <laughs> so I grabbed them. They do have a bit of a jagged edge. So that's good. A power tip. Um, the only thing I was a bit reluctant with these were, I think these, yeah, they're a medium, not a soft. Usually I buy soft for us, but I think the medium will be fine. So anyway, for $1, we can give them a go and see what we think. I think they'll be fine. I just got what it was a purple and a blue, but yeah, what a great deal for Colgate. I was really happy about those oh my gosh we love these things if you've been watching the last couple of grocery hauls I'm sure I filmed it already where I talked about these little bags of they're like these but they've got tiny little bits in them at Coles they're a home brand sort of selection from Coles and there's 10 bags in a box for about $5.50 I think um, I couldn't get them the last time I was there so I bought the actual long big fruit bars 
and they've been okay. They're, oh, I don't know how much they were. I think they were about $5. They're okay, but we didn't love all the flavors and it was just, it's kind of something I don't want to keep buying because we don't really enjoy them. Like Johnny and I are eating them because they're there and we're like, we don't want to waste them. And instead of having something else, that's what we'll have. Like instead of a muesli bar, we'll have that. But the kids aren't keen on them. These I know we love. They're absolutely delicious. They're not huge ones. They're like mini ones. So they're perfect for the lunchbox. Just one of those in. A box of these is $2 actually at NQR. And I'm pretty sure you can get these because I've bought them before at uh, the reject shop for about the same price as well. They might be $2.50 there, but NQR, they were $2. Now, use by date is not until, what, October? So that's excellent. This just means they're selling them cheap. And I have seen them in there a lot recently. So they are something. There is another flavor you can get, but we just love the, what is it, strawberry and blueberry is what we like. I might open one of these up just to show you how big they are. Um, but yeah, if you like the little fruit bars, these are a really good choice. And like I said, they're just something extra to put in the lunchbox. Um, they're not going to fill them up, obviously. <laughs> they're not the healthiest thing, but they're a nice little sweet treat to put in there. So the fact is, what is that? So 10 bars, because there's five in a box, 10 bars for $4, as opposed to me buying the other things in the little bags, which we love the little bags, strawberry thingies in Coles. I can't remember what they were, but what you'll see them on an upcoming video. They were what five dollars or five dollars fifty. So this is saving a dollar, dollar fifty. So that's a good deal. They come in this little gold bag. So there you go. You can sort of see. So they're about maybe two inches long. I would say they're very nice, guys. Try them if you haven't. If you don't have an NQR, buy them from the reject shop. They're delicious. And then the last thing I got was this party bag of paws, Cheetos paws. I've never seen these in the normal supermarket at all. I thought these were interesting. I want they say party bag, but I feel like they're smaller than the regular party bag we see in the supermarkets of like Twisties and the other Cheetos and stuff. But these were $2. That's why I got them. Rhiannon when I was on video chat with her, she did get some of these and I just thought, "Oh, I'll try them because we like a cheesy sort of flavor." Um but I thought too the kids would love them. They're just a novelty thing to have the be the pause. So, I thought we'd give these a go. Let's see. Well, I'll open them up and show you guys what it looks like. But do we have a date on them? I'm trying to find a use by date. Oh, here we go. May 19th. So plenty of time. I'm going to open them to show you. So we'll probably eat these in the next two days <laughs> anyway. Oh my God. These are the cutest thing ever. These are like, they remind me of Snuggles. His little paws. These are so cute. I'll try them. I'll give the kids some. We'll see what we think. But these would be great if you could get these bags at $2 each. I might even go back for more and break them down into smaller snack bags. It's going to be a bargain instead of spending a lot of money on, you know, bags of chips and shapes and stuff for school lunchboxes. This is something else that we could do. So hopefully they're nice, but they are so cute. Going to try them. Mmm. They're so yum. You guys, if you go to the NQR, try them. They're delicious. They taste like the... Cole's home brand, uh, what are they called? Tubes, I think. I think I've put the video up recently. I think it was in the most recent grocery haul, I'm pretty sure. They were like a dollar ninety for the bag. That's a bargain. But if you've got the NQR and you want to get something a bit more of a novelty, like the little paws, they are delicious. They taste like those. They're very, very nice. Kind of like cheesels, but really soft. They're really yummy. So there is my little NQR midnight haul, guys, for you to enjoy. Um, it wasn't a lot of stuff, but I thought I would share it. Because maybe, you know, maybe you've got one near you right now and you want to get these deals, then you can. They're sort of there. They do change week to week, so you have to be onto it. So NQR shops, I try to put up as soon as possible on the channel when I do them because it's you know two weeks later it's not there anymore usually so I like to try to put it up so that's why I did it so late tonight I thought if I don't do it now I won't do it at all so I want to share it with you guys um obviously I've got no NQR hauls at the moment here on the channel but I was doing them previously uh, before I sort of restarted things so keep an eye on the channel I'll do them I may do some shot with me's we'll see about that it's it's a it's, I enjoy doing them because it shows you guys stuff and you guys always want me to do shop with me in NQR, but it's a small store, so I don't know if I'll get in trouble at times. 
so I don't know I just kind of do it if I can and if it's quiet in there I'll do it so it's usually a bit of a quick thing but otherwise I just do the hauls and you get guys get to see you know current things that I purchased and stuff but it is always good to take you guys in there if I can because especially if you don't live very close to one so it gives you guys an idea of what they are and then some of you guys have said that you've gone looking for the stores and you know traveled to different places to actually see them so it's worth me showing you guys it's a bit like a Costco Costco you can't you know you can't see prices and catalogs and stuff like that so it's nice to watch them um, you know the videos on YouTube and Costco don't mind at all us filming so that's quite open it's easy to do but I think because it's such a big store it's not too much of an issue but yeah I don't know we'll see how we go with the NQR because I know people are going to ask me to do shop with me so we'll just play it by ear and see what I can do who knows we'll see anyway guys um, that's it for me tonight thanks so much for watching and I'll see you probably tomorrow bye